Hey guys in YouTube land, this is Larry out here in uh, Yorktown. I uh, ran across this guy, uh, Bill, from the gym, and I was going to tell you about his motorcycle. Tell me about uh, your motorcycle, Bill. Well, it's a 1969 Electroglide. I've had it from 2005. Tore it down four years ago, and this is how it sits right now. I'm hoping Larry will give me some inspiration <laughs> to suck it back together. I know what you mean, I know what you mean. The older you get, the harder it is to do that. This is a pretty bike. It's a pretty bike, and it's about three-fourths of the way together, you think? Yeah, pretty much. Okay. So what? So what do you do to it after you start, after you get it all fixed up? So you get back on the road because it looks it looks it looks new. It looks brand new from here. It makes me sick on well, mine. Once I get back on the road, I'll let you ride it once, and then I'm gonna put it up for sale. All right, I might ride it to California and back. <laughs> <laughs> it looks it looks. I ain't kidding. It looks a lot better than mine. Yeah. This is this is mine's a '68 and his is '69, but he's got his really spiffed up here. I yeah. like it. It makes, it makes me jealous to look at this bike. And all the sheet metal's painted, waiting to be put back on. Where'd you uh, buy it from? Where'd I buy this from? Yeah, uh huh. I actually traded. Oh, you did? I traded it for that orange bike, that orange bike I was just showing. Oh, okay, that's on the wall over there, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you traded even? Yeah. Oh, yeah? Okay. But, uh, did you buy, I guess you traded here in, uh, in the peninsula yeah, the here guy somewhere. Was, the guy was from Williamsburg. Oh, yeah, okay. Co worker. Co worker? Yeah. All right. It looks nice. I like this for a bike. I really like it a lot. So I walked in the door. I said, "Man, this thing looks a lot better than mine." You put some, you put some time and effort in this rascal. Make this thing look pretty. Well, I'm, I stripped it down to a frame, and I figured if I'm putting it back together, I want it to look good. Yeah. Otherwise, I would have just left it the way it was when I bought it. Yeah. It's all rusty looking. Yeah. What, what, what year did you say it was? Sixty-nine. Sixty-nine. That's a good year. Yeah. It's, uh, the last of the pan shovels. It sure is. Yeah, when I first saw that bike, I, and the other guy owned it, I saw it and I thought, oh man, I'd love to have that motorcycle. <laughs> but I know he was looking at my orange bike. Say the same thing. Thinking the same thing. So you say you say y'all traded heads up? Yeah. Hey, what's your uh, let's see your, your fender? I your seat up there, and your fenders are over here, right? Yeah. What's your gas tank at? It's up here. It's wrapped. I got it wrapped up. Okay. Can't really tell. But that's the paint scheme on it. It's it looks. It looks the paint. The paint job looks brand new. Is that is that new? Yeah. Yeah. You haven't you haven't rode it. Had it on the bike I yet. Had it right? On the bike once. For okay. a while, and then I I stripped this back down because the frame was all falling apart. Or not falling apart, but the paint was chipping off. Yeah, I know what you mean. Like mine is now. <laughs> mine, mine does so that I, now. You know, and everything else was looking good on it. I thought, man, I got to change this, do something with this frame. So I tore it down four years ago, and yeah. I just kind of lost interest in trying to get it back together. But I know once it's back together, I'm going to love it. Yeah, I'm loving it right now because it looks pretty. <laughs> looks nice. All right, guys. I'm going to cut y'all loose out there on YouTube land. And uh, y'all have a good day.